Hi there folks, my name's Rich Burdess, I work for Datacom in Christchurch, um, New Zealand um, as a power platform type of person um, with a SharePoint experience. Um, so what I'm presenting today is a quick overview of how you could use Power Apps and Flow to help you with employee inductions. Um, there are lots of other tools out there um, that can help do this need as well, but Power Apps, if you've already got Office 365, could provide a, a low cost entry into that space. So this app uses SharePoint as its main data source, uh, as well as the Office 365 users connection. And it's taken inspiration from the onboarding, or get on board app, sorry, um, and the company Pulse app that you can download um, as a Power App um, whenever you use or begin using Power Apps, already pre-canned um, templates you can use, and those are awesome. Um, and so this uses um, a similar approach, um, but not quite the same, so hopefully a little bit different. Um, the SharePoint list is used for um, knowing when a new employee is going to start and a flow is triggered seven days before that employee begins to populate tasks in a task list um, and assign it to that user um, and then an email sent out to that user um, to their home address or the home email address um, invited them to come in and kick off their induction um, and then each of the days of their induction have different um, tasks assigned per day um, they can then update them via the app um, and then view their team, who they're going to work with, reach out to them, explore them on Delve um, sort of approach and then also get to know the company a bit better as well. If they get stuck, um, key help tools are available in, in the help section as well. So what we've done is try to create a um, like a, a corporate looking app um, it's using quite a lot of semi-transparent um, and hovers. Um, same with the navigation through the app as well. So it could be easily used on a, a tablet or a desktop. Um, so just basically simple, visible, show hide elements for a collection that uses um, a local collection in the app with the navigation elements added to it. Um, and then on the home screen, the different ways to connect through to get to the different screens. So to quickly dive into the tasks, the so tasks exist in a regular old SharePoint task list and then selected day, day one for this particular view. Um, and then assigned users um, who can help um, who the task is assigned to um, and then the flow kicks off and then in SharePoint itself we've got a bunch of stories um, to show you in the newsfeed how they present um, and dive back in okay so we'll start off with day one tasks quick call to the SharePoint task list get the information we need um, and then copying the dynamics onboarding thing, thanks guys, um, of a possible way to do work. So each of the um, tasks for day one um, handles a particular piece and then if there's a photo for the user or a contact person then they can do that. Um, and then also for up at changing employee photo we use the Office 365 user photo connector um, to change the user's photo if they want to. Um, or assuming that they haven't got a photo yet because that is the first time through the app um, and it's basically all we're doing um, mark is complete a patch runs against the SharePoint list or task list and then updates it so do that again cool so there we go um, and then as we see in the task list if I refresh this those tasks are getting updated for the photo, so the employee photo, if I jump into my Office 365, that's me at the moment looking like a colleague of mine. And if I want to change my picture to somebody else or to the real me, I can jump in, um, get pictures, get a picture of the, the real me. I'm in here somewhere, yeah, that'll do. Hopefully that's a all right, it's a bit fuzzy. Let's change that to something else. Another version of me. This one's good. There we go. And then click Use Photo. That goes off, updates my profile, and it also does a quick um, refresh the data source, a clear collect um, of my profile through to the next screen as well. But in Office Suite 5 itself, the app has updated my picture. Now, you'll notice um, on some of these elements that once you change a picture um, your profile may not update quickly through um, the the various elements of um, the, the inbuilt Office 365 connection so that, that will happen over time but within the app itself um, as soon as I've updated it if I could jump into um, my team view 
there my pictures already changed there so while I'm on Teams using the my peers lookup um, through Office 365 users um, see who I work with um, and then a couple of guest accounts we've got so if you're a new user you come in you could click on this you could reach out and see what they're up to um, go into delve and explore them uh, also key links um, within certain documents that you might need to present to your team before they start as well as web links and what we've tried to do here is put in a, um, an icon based on the type of um, link that is available now these use um, the launch capability of Power Apps to take you to the document library open the file itself um, for the PDFs we could use the um, the PDF viewer um, tool as well if say we had a PDF that a user had to view uh, in the app and then tick a box to say yep confirm read type stuff as part of an induction step that could be a really cool way to do that as well but this app just shows um, links to those th those bits of content uh, I'll dive through to the next section my company uh, what we're doing here is Yammer um, SharePoint and then company resources from a document library of key pieces for um, that team um, so a filtered view of a document library based on uh, metadata columns so what we've got using Yammer post getting the, the picture of the person that posted their name when they posted how many likes are available and then what the first sort of hundred or so characters of the, the post with a link to take you to um, that the rest of the post should you want to see it um, and I've limited that to six um, items um, there and again also with the company news again a limit um, just so we don't you're going to hit too many thresholds and try and pull too much data in but basically stories um, that are posted in the company news feed uh, with the user that, that posted um, it's always me at the moment um, basically a link through but then a click through to view it and then so that we're taking the the image the story the first part of the um, the description um, field um, and then that basically would take you to this type of page um, if you clicked through to view it. Um, that's how that one works. Then the last screen to show is the help screen. This is basically, doesn't have to be videos, but what I've done is um, presenting videos. Um, so based on what people can and basically changing, based on the clicks, changing the data source here of the, the particular view, um, using some old Microsoft clips from back in the day. Um, but they could easily be, um, you know, one could be a video, one could be a list of um, key points of contact, one could be a form or a direct link to the service desk, how to get help. The, obviously a first um, item piece would be how to use the induction app, which I haven't got a video for yet, but this could be it. Um, but basically, yeah, step through, um, allow the users the ability to, to, to view something a bit more engaging before they join the company. So there could easily be videos about the company, um, how their team works, all that sort of stuff as well. It'd be, be quite cool to present if you're a new employee coming and give you a really good experience when you first join. Um, but that's that's the app. Um, it's a concept to to improve um, the onboard the onboarding experience for for employees. Everybody has to onboard at some time when they join a company. Lots of tools can do it. Um, Power Apps is also in that mix now as a, as a as an option that can help. Um, hope you found this clip useful. Any questions? Just yeah, reach out, um, reply um, as needed, and I'll be back in touch. Thanks very much.